Ryslip is a village in Hillingdon in London, England. Ryslip Lido is a reservoir and artificial beach in Ryslip. Hi guys, we are at the place called Ryslip Lido, which is about 40 minutes from Harrow. It is effectively a reservoir, water park with an artificial or man-made beach. And so we're just going to walk around the water and see what we can capture. So come along, enjoy the walk with us. So these are the rules. Drones are not permitted. Birds are not allowed to be fed. Birds and waterfowl, no lifeguards on duty. And there are some fishing rules. Luckily, we're here to just eat and take a walk. I think it's less than two kilometers. All in all, so it should be a manageable walk. We are lucky. We came on a day and a time that there are not many people and that is the sandy beach over there, man-made beach and I guess on a weekend that would be really crowded but today it's kind of empty. So let's get over there and see what it's like. We see a cafe up ahead and I think that's where our immediate destination will be because we're really hungry. Is it your first time? Yes, this is my first time to come here. Okay, what are we having for lunch? So I am having fish and chips and you are going to have your burger. Ooh, yes, it's a beef burger with chips of course if you can get a burger after all. I think that's going to be very happy. Yes, it's the way to go instead it's of a salad. It's going to be failing. Yep, and I'm so looking forward to my meal. Okay. It is lunchtime. It is lunchtime. It's now almost 12 noon. And we had breakfast so at 5. 5.30 <laughs> this morning. So we are very hungry famished. or famished. Okay, food should be here any moment now. Cutlery is on the side and sauces. Perfect, thank you. We had a lovely meal, a hamburger, and a fish and chips. <laughs> yes, the hamburger was uh, so so was very local. <laughs> Jimmy, but very local. Yes. Uh, but it was beautiful, I emptied the plate. This is an exciting part of Ryslip Lido. There's a road down there, a, a paved path. But we are up here in the interior, walking on ground. Soil, which kind of resembles the trails back in Brunei. We are here by the water's edge. And I'm trying to wait for some ducks, swans, geese, anything that will come here. Someone forgot to So that I can actually here. reach out with my small camera Hello. and take a close-up shot. Yeah, so I see some ducks on the water, but they're too far away. And I don't have bread. And I don't have bread to feed them. 
This is a beautiful place. You just sit here for hours, enjoy the weather, the sky is blue. Come to the water's edge. Yes, it's a pretty, it's a beautiful place. We're now gonna take a brisk walk because uh, we have uh, captured some clips by the water's edge already and there are no ducks, swans, nothing on this side so we're gonna try and walk a little bit faster to make up for time and then if we're lucky we'll catch those birds further along this trail. <sighs> All right, <laughs> let's enjoy a bit of the sun. Sitting on a bench here. Empty field. Yes, there's With empty space. Nothing. And we're admiring that. So we feel the heat of the sun, but at the same time, the weather is cool. What, what is it? Like, what, nine degrees here? It's or something 16 like that? 16 degrees. 16 degrees here. And just marveling at God's creation. Like if you can hear the birds and nature. the birds around us, yes. Nature appreciation. Stop. Stopping to appreciate nature. Choo choo! Wait long. Bye bye. <laughs> Probably no train today. But yeah, there is a train that goes around the reservoir. You know, we're in nature. And so my eyes are like on the lookout for trails. Like this, you know, like we're walking on soil. And there's like vegetation all around us trees and shrubbery and so like yeah one of the things I like to do is get on the trail but oh this is a lovely spot huh. water's edge we can sit down here by the water yeah ooh duck I'm trying to capture the ducks up close with this Insta360 and this selfie stick but I think I'm gonna have to wait all day for the ducks to come really close so maybe another time see look at them they're just right there Okay, unfortunately, that's the most I can do. <laughs> Amazing, there's lots of waterfowl here. They couldn't get close enough for me to capture them on my selfie stick and my tiny little camera. But if not, we're happy with the pictures we've taken and the videos we've taken. And this will go nicely into the vlog. totally useless. I've been trying to get a close-up of the waterfowl for about two hours now. 
I think they know that they're being videoed, so they are skipping it. Look, I don't know if you see it, but right behind me, there's a, there are a number of ducks on the water. So we are almost done with our round of rice lip lido. We uh, tried to get some shots of waterfowl close up, but unfortunately they're a bit shy. But this is nonetheless a beautiful place. As you can see, there's lots of there are lots of mothers with their young ones, babies going around. You know, people who have taken a break from work, just taking a nice stroll, or some elderly couples just you know taking an easy walk around the park. If you haven't been, I recommend you drop by, spend about two hours here. There's a cafe there to grab some food if you happen to get hungry. That's it guys, if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, leave a comment if you've been here, tell us what you like about the place, and I will see you in the next one.